don't, don't stop, Chef. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Don't be too generous. We have to get it at about exactly the same weight as the other ones. You can do that with raspberry jam, but if you do the raspberry jam, you need to make sure that um, what's the weight, Chef? We want like 2.75. Two point seven five. It depends on your dough. So that first one's always the trial one. Yeah. That's the sample. Okay, so that's your size. <laughs> For your dough. See, I'm not the only one. I'm surprised you keep calling me that. I'm crippled. It takes me longer. Okay, so you guys can do the rest. Alright, so now. The raspberry filling, I'm sorry. You could do, if you want. You could do um, <laughs> raspberry jam, okay. but very thin. Very thin. Okay. Don't do it like because it's not the filling. Right. It's just to add dimension to your to your shapes. All right. So once you get your um, twist done, so this is what we're doing, but it's kind of tight right now. It still needs to relax a little bit. If it bites you, then. dimension you won't get as you roll it out, okay? All right, this is the hard part. It just needs to relax a little bit more. All right, so when you place it on a, ta on a, uh, a board, you're going to do it loose, okay? So in the middle, you give it space, like this, okay? And then you wrap this gently around. Do not do it tightly. And then this comes just underneath, okay? It should be quite loose, not um, tight. If it's tight, it'll come up like a pineapple, and that's not desirable. All right? So the longer ones are actually better because they don't need as much cajoling, if you will. But this this is needs a lot more. That's a nice <laughs> I didn't learn that. <laughs> There's a lot of shapes you could do at this point. Um, so, oh, yeah. you might want to let this rest now yeah. at this point, and then come back to it. Okay? So, you're going in opposite directions. This is a little guy. Cover it, let it rest for a couple minutes. All right.